Hey guys, this is Maria, the music director at RSU Radio, and it's time for another music director vlog. Before we get started, just to remind you guys, stay masked up, hands washed, music in, world out. Basically, I'm going to run you through some of my favorite releases that came last month, the month of October. First up, we have a band out of Chicago called Slow Pulp. You might have heard of them. They released a four-track EP last year, and it generated a lot of buzz, which was great for them. And uh, running off of that buzz, they have released their debut album, Movies, and it didn't disappoint. It was really great. Dreamy vocals, driving guitar, and pulsing drums. Super catchy, super fun stuff. So check out Slow Pulp Movies. Up next, I have a Biba Doobie with Fake It Flowers. If you have TikTok, you've heard of this girl. Her track, Coffee, went huge in 2017. It was all over YouTube, and I've heard it everywhere since, but... Yeah, she blew up way back in the day, and after she blew up, she recorded a couple of EPs after signing to, I think it was Dirty Hit Records, and now she has a debut album out, and it is incredible. I can't rant and rave about it enough. It is like full-on 90s grunge goodness. She still has her DIY feel of her earlier tracks, but it has got this new 90s rock sound, which is really interesting to see a young Gen Z artist rocking that sound and bringing it back. So Biba Doobie, Fake It Flowers, really great stuff. Up next, it's a bit of a smaller artist, Mr. Gnome, and they came out with a brand new double album. This thing has 26 songs. It is gigantic, but this album is called The Day You Flew Away, and it is so catchy, so fun, and it has very angelic vocals and distorted guitars, really unique melodies. I think it's a really, really cool listen. If you're looking for something different, check out Mr. Gnome, The Day You Flew Away. Up next, I have Poppy Shiitake. This is another fun one. He just came out with an EP called Quarantine Dream. If you're wondering what that sounds like, think bedroom pop, reverb heavy, Mac DeMarco-esque instrumentals. If you're a fan of Mac DeMarco, you will probably like this guy's stuff. Uh, next, I want to talk about some awesome stuff coming this month in November. There is so much to look forward to. Um, who could have guessed it? King Gizzard and the Lizard Wizard is coming out with something else. I mean, I feel like no matter what state of disarray the world is in, we can always count on King Gizzard. They will do something. They will have something for us. So their brand new album, KG, is coming this month. We also have the Darcy's with Fear and Loneliness to look forward to. And lastly, Yukon Blonde with their brand new album, Vindicator. And we're airing the last single that they just released right now. It is really something to look forward to. So that is all for today. Thank you guys for hanging out with me, going through some October releases and some things to look forward to. So stay healthy, stay safe, and stay happy.